what's the status of the guys that are out tonight? Uh, any hope for anybody? Uh, Kujawinski's questionable. We'll see how he feels. Lower body. Black's been sick. Uh, he's been officially diagnosed with a sinus infection, I think. So he's questionable, depending on how he feels. Other than that, uh, Lappin is is certainly not available this weekend at all. Um, up, upper body and, and McKelvey upper body, um, highly doubtful. No matter how pleaded things get, you seem to find guys that come in and, and, and do the job. It's got to be a nice feeling to see that kind of depth in the. Yeah, you know, well, this is these are extreme situations right here now. Uh, but, uh, you know, I talk to guys about, you know, our structure and our habits and the details of our game, which have been great all year and have allowed us to. You know, maybe insert at times guys like, you know, a Max Novak or a, or or Johnson or even early in the season Kujawinski. You know, Black and now these guys have been regulars in our lineup and and we're, you know, we're real thin in the sense that we you know we don't even have twelve forwards. So um, it's a little more uh, ice time for a lot of guys. I thought Gunnar Hughes came in and did a great job. I thought Ben Johnson, who's been with us and, and used. Uh, uh, been in and out of the lineup was was exceptional tonight, and then the guys that are supposed to be good were good for us. And uh, O'Neill was back; he's fresh. Uh, we went with seven D. Uh, uh, Paul Grider's come in and done a good job for us. So uh, you get to see some things, but um, you know, even the Bridgeport game, I, I thought we maybe ran out of gas just as a result of losing two guys. Um, but it's still going to be a grind. Uh, you, but you got to rely on 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 what got you here, regardless of who's in the lineup. And I thought we did that tonight.